Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to Air Power. It's that time of year again, and I'm excited to fire up the grill and get some steaks in. But first, I got some content for you guys. All right. All right guys, we got the grill set up and fired up. I'm letting that thing preheat and get warmed up good. While I have a camera sitting down here on the chronograph, we have the Air Boss. 49 grain pellets and we're going to test out the speeds this new hammer spring and we're about I'm going to say 200 about 230 bar on the gauge if that's if you can read that if it's legible this thing is stiff I have the hammer spring when I put it in uh, I put in the adjustment screw and I just barely got to the end of the set screw hole. You can see inside the set screw hole. I just barely got to the end of that and then I put the set screw in. So let's go ahead with our first shots. This is not filled all the way up. Hopefully we're over the chronograph. Something's not right. 548's way too slow. Way too slow. Seven fifty seven, that's a lot better. I don't know what happened with that first shot. The second shot was air. I'll have the foot pounds of energy up here. 757 feet per second. That was air as well. I have three rounds gone out of here. Seven forty six. The spring may be really weak in these mags. Seven forty seven. This ain't, it's not chambering. Let's keep going. Maybe it'll chamber. That's a duplicate. 747. I don't think we got anything out of there. 743. 744. No trigger. No pellet in there. Seven thirty-nine, guys. When I first shot this over the chronograph, I should have had it on video. I only fired one shot over it. It was seven fifty-two, if I'm not mistaken. If you're a big fan, you've seen the community post of uh, the numbers I put in. It says seven thirty-nine. I don't know if we fired a round or not. Seven forty. Seven thirty five, seven thirty four, duplicate, seven thirty three, seven twenty eight, seven twenty four, seven twenty eight. That is it. So it started cycling well when this when the mag got low uh lower and uh that's probably a weak weak hammer i mean a weak spring in the magazine 
and uh, we have 200 on the gauge if that's in frame if it's focused 200 bar uh, it we probably would have got the 752 and a little higher on the first few shots if the rifle was topped all the way up but let's go down here and take a look at this group we're only we're only at a 15 yard distance all right guys so that's that's the group of 15 yards uh, it could have been better with me uh, not having to stop and wonder where my uh, where my shots were when it wasn't loading them and uh, there's the distance back there it's just a let's put it right up against the target that's about 15 yards away and there's your group 16 rounds uh, I have my red dot here apparently I need to adjust it to the left I'll keep it high and next time I can just aim under here instead of here anyway well, there you guys go a new hammer spring a new hammer and uh, we're getting a lot more foot pounds of energy out of the blitz I really want to save the 54 grain Nielsen slugs for the Terminator when I get it back I really want to see what they're slinging out of the blitz how much the speeds have went up with this new spring and hammer but uh, we'll do that later on right now I'm getting back to the grill air powers out